Hello everyone. Welcome to the channel Knowledge24. In our previous lecture, we discussed about various techniques of debugging the program. So in this, we discussed about three techniques and the third technique was code tracing and code stepping. In this technique, we use debugging tool. So in this lecture, we will learn about debugging tool and how to debug the program in Python ideally. So let's start with the debugging tool. Debugging tool or debugger is a specialized software or computer program which is used to test the program or debug the program which is written in any specific programming language. The debugger can be a separate program or it can be a integrated with the IDEs. Python provides the separate program, separate debugger program which is called PDP means Python debugger and Python ideally also provide the debugging tool. If you want to run the code with the debugger tool then firstly you have to turn on this feature by select debug then click on debugger from the python ideally menu bar then you will see debug is on and it is appear just before the prompt it means the interpreter is ready and waiting now when you execute your program then the debugger window will appear and now you can inspect the values of local and global variable here a step is used to execute the current line and go to the next one line till the end and you can only step forward in time throughout your program execution so when you debug this program then it firstly debug the first line means line by line it will debug then we click on the step button so it will go to the step number second means line number two and debug it here the value of sum is zero now we click on the step button again then it will debug the third line sum equal to sum plus i now then the value of i and sum equal to zero zero now when we click on again step button then it will debug the fourth line which is print function so it will execute the print function and go to the print function library so it will debug the print function and then we click on the step button then we again go to the second line means go to the for loop because the condition is true now i's value is 1 and then again we click on the step and so on so we click on the step and the loop will continue till the i equal to 5 when the loop is over then it will go to the fifth line means just after the for loop and here the value of i equal to 5 and sum is 15 so this is the working of debugger step by step in python ideally thank you